What's up you guys? Thank you for clicking on this video, virtually hanging out with me. This video is gonna be all jean talk, basically. I am on the hunt for the perfect pair of jeans. I have a vision in my mind and I will not settle until I find something that perfectly fits the vision that I have. And I know they're out there, but I just have to find them. I do have a few pair of jeans that I really love. I did a video comparing my Zara ones, the mom jean, which is like a Z1975, I believe, to the Levi wedgies. I love both of them but those are ankle length jeans like they hit at the ankle love them but what i'm looking for right now is a kind of like a classic 90s early 2000s mid-rise darker denim preferably zip fly because i'm not crazy about button flies but it's not a deal breaker straight leg long inseam jean i want it to fit kind of like snug in the hips and the waist and in the back where it's like form fitting but then a straight leg all the way down. Not tapered, not bootleg, not flared, just like a true straight leg. Something that will look really cute with sneakers and something that would look really, really cute with heels. So I was searching the internet and jeans can be really, really expensive. So I didn't want to pay a lot of money. That's another requirement. I don't want it to be super expensive. So I saw some from Gap and they looked like they might be exactly what I'm looking for, but unfortunately they're not. I am going to keep one of them. The other one, I probably gonna return because it's just not really what I was looking for but I'll try them on to share them for you guys nonetheless in case you're also looking for jeans and maybe you're looking for something different than I am the first one is the gap denim stretch 90s loose and I got it in this darker denim I'll link the color down below and because these are a 90s loose like a loose jean and I didn't want them to be loose I went down a size so I personally got a size 2 26 usually I'm like a 4 all across the board on average I would say I'm usually a four but for these I got a 26 inch waist size two which in Abercrombie some of their shorts I do have I am in the size two so I guess it just depends but I wanted something a little bit more snug so I went down a size and I love the color the only thing I don't like is the fading like on the back here I don't like this fading I wish they were all just dark denim and then it has some fading in the front which I'm not crazy about like right here I wish it was just like all one solid color they are a true jean material so another thing is i don't want them to be stretchy at all the next pair of jeans have a little bit of stretch to them i don't like jeans that are stretchy i need rigid like true vintage levi's doesn't stretch at all and those are usually pretty comfortable for me but i hate jeans that are stretchy any amount of stretch i hate it and these are 99 percent cotton one percent spandex and that one percent spandex gives them just the teensiest bit of stretch not too much but I do wish it was like 100% cotton. And the material is a bit on the thinner side. So with Levi's, their premium collection, like the Levi wedgies that I have, those are thick jean material. Like they're not thin. These are really thin. Like I feel like they could easily rip. So that was a little bit disappointing as well. So this is the size two. It does have a little bit of stretch. I don't have, I'm not like curvy by any means. So these don't look as attractive as the Levi wedgies on me personally, but if you are curvier, I feel like the waist would be a little bit too loose, but these are called the 90s baggy. And I like how they fit right here. I feel like it's a genuinely true mid-rise, fits snugger here. It's hard showing full length when the video goes this way vertically, not horizontal, but this is the length. They sit just at the top of the foot. I'm 5'6", I'm not that tall, but I do wish they were maybe an inch longer but the length is actually not bad so they're not bad but they're just not 100 percent what i was looking for so these are the first jeans if you're looking for something like this like you love a mid-rise i used to love high rise but i have a very short torso and i've learned that it makes me look shorter like it makes my torso look even shorter so i've been switching a lot of my jeans to mid-rise it took me a little bit of time to learn but you live and learn in life i say so i love a good mid-rise these next ones i going to be returning as soon as i saw them i feel like i already knew they had that jegging look to them i don't know if you can tell the blue is a little bit too blue it's a nice blue but it's not this kind of blue. like this looks like a jean blue this looks like a fake jegging blue to me so i knew as soon as i saw them i'm like no these are not going to be it and lo and behold i don't know why i read the description but i must have missed it or had a brain fart or something 98 percent cotton two percent spandex so i thought oh that'll be fine now they're way too stretchy for my liking like i touch them and i'm like no this is way too much stretch it doesn't have that jean material that i'm looking for and i'm not crazy about how they fit so these are the 90s straight and i had really really high hopes for these 
although they are high rise slim through the hip and thigh and it is a straight leg it is a true straight leg funny enough these are a 27 inch waist and i feel like they're definitely way more snug right here which i love if we can take the fit of this put it on those jeans and take the material of like a premium levi wedgie i feel like we would have it these are a high rise so they hit probably right above my belly button here's the length right here i do wish they were probably two inches longer like this is not the length that i'm looking for it's not like with heels it would just look kind of ridiculous and then this is the fit so this is the 90s straight they're very comfortable like ridiculously comfortable but they're just not for me i'm not crazy about them not exactly what i was looking for so these are going to be returned they are cute they're just not for me the search for the perfect jean continues you know of any stores that are like under a hundred dollars not going to cost me 150 dollars let me know but the search continues so i hope you guys found this video helpful those are my thoughts on that if you're looking for jeans and i hope to see you guys in future videos